Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today we came with a new video for you all as we have the water pumps, chill water pumps. We have the four water pumps in our systems. So let's have an explanation about the water pumps, how it works, what are its instruments in the, the systems. As you can see how we have and what are the functions of the water pumps in the HVAC systems. So let's see with the word, first word pumps over here we have basically four water pumps in the row. So this is the first chill water pumps. Here we have the three phase chill water pump which speeds work on the variant speeds. This is our inlet coming from the outside of the chill water and which is coming and this one we have the circulation pump which circulated towards the building area. So as we have the pressure gear valves, valves which we have explained you before as it is connected to the each and every part of our system. So now our first system is working here we have the diffusers for the all three motors. We have the now one motor is working at the currently as you can see it's working and the noisy so there is a little bit issue with this motor it's a bearing issue so this is our oil container which helps us to inside the uh, functioning of the motor toward the rotor which can move frequently here we can you can see water comes from there and passes towards the building inside the building there we have the valves which is basically command from the BMS whenever we need the water uh, valve to be open it's work upon the BMS system as if it's BMS system spell then we can operate it manually also that we have the wheel over there so it can be operated manually also these all our dis diffusers here we have the module sets for the ETS rooms we can say that how much the water is being consumed and how much the BTU is being circulated towards the towards the uh, units and here we have whenever we need to do the water treatment like we need to add the chemical or something like that we use this area to add the chemical as you can see we have the chemical has been added towards our water and the functioning being progress. We have the two tanks manually or simultaneously it being used whenever we need it we just fill the water and we set for the measurements how much seconds and how much water it has to be circulated. So currently now it's being off because it's already being treated. So here we have the heat exchanger where the heat is being exchanged. So we have the five heat exchanger. The reason we have the heat exchanger over here is we got the water from the supplying company. So here the water is coming from supplying company and we are taking the coolness of this water. This water is going towards the building and this is coming towards from the supplying area and we have the upper part and the lower part of the heat exchangers heat exchanger inside itself two units which is upper and the lower unit as this is coming to the uh, going towards the building area and this is coming from the third party area which is they have circulated the cool chill water so here we have the gauge water gauge pressure and then we have all this uh, valves which is being operated from the BMS and then we have the water scale temperature how much the water is coming inside the temperature as we can see that we have the 11 degrees Celsius water temperature coming inside the building so next we can see here also the almost the same we have the 10 degrees Celsius is coming and we have all meters and measurements to look as we have the units like now it's we have the floor switch over here so it's 13.22 usually per minute like uh, the flow of water flow rate the flow rates being over here so 
this was a short and sweet explanation for you to ex- understand how exactly it works and uh, it's work under the commercial areas where we have the large buildings like hotels hospitals in airports uh, this area has been these instruments and the tools will be used over there so i hope you will enjoy with this video if you feel something do not shy to ask the questions regarding the systems then we can help you out for the explanation and we'll try our best to give you the best explanation so thank you for watching the videos hopefully subscribe to my channel so that i can bring the new new and uh, interesting videos for you okay thank you